Well, hello, this is Slingshot Warrior, and I want to show you my finished target. And, um, this is it. <laughs> um, I, uh, I basically, uh, wrapped it, or should I say taped it, with, uh, with Gorilla Tape and Duct Tape. And, um... And this is what I did. I basically, uh, I think, um, I'm not sure. I think, uh, my buddy Bo Krause was, uh, worried about mold and, uh, weather damage because it's cardboard. And I worry about similar things, but I know how to have, but I come up with solutions to this. Several layers of Gorilla Tape and, and duct tape will solve that problem <laughs> all over the box, as you can see. There is no place where this one, where there isn't Gorilla Tape on both ends of the box. Duct Tape. Duct Tape. <laughs> and as you can see, this is a, uh, this is my new crossbow target and it's been water sealed with tape. <laughs> this is, a. Uh, I bought a whole bunch of this colored duct tape from Walmart. Now, the reason why it's colored, why I chose colored duct tape to uh, to cover this up, um, like the orange and the uh, and the uh, zombie green, you could say, um, is um, because when I'm shooting it, I want my fans to see it, see the target. And um, what better way to see the target with with bright colors. <laughs> so I made sure the tape was bright colored tape. <laughs> Just for my fans with uh, some uh, Gorilla Tape on both ends, both ends of the, um, both top and bottom end and and in the middle. Uh, it's been sealed with, it's been closed in, clo the box has been closed with Gorilla Tape. And um, you see I put my paper target on there, my Diamond shaped target. <laughs> it's numbered and color coded in bright colors. Uh, just to match this new target. Well, uh, as you can see, I I completed this target. And you've seen, and this is basically the final stage. This is basically the, it, it's all finished now. One is later. Bye.